Uh, let's see, we don't necessarily want this to be the Elden Ring show uh, every week or whatever, however we put out the episodes. I think it's been like a month since like episode one. It's just scheduling issues. Um, we, we will but, we will acknowledge, listen, I will clown myself for this. I did not know that there were checkpoints in the game. I just recently discovered that. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, we're, we're talking, uh, we're, we're talking Elden Ring. This is, uh, yeah, we, we, I, I don't necessarily want it to be the Elden Ring show because, you know, everyone's playing it and it is what it is. Um, but man, this game's fucking long as shit and there's no possible way we're not going to be able to talk about it, especially when it's this fucking good. Yeah, no, El Elden Ring is cool. And before I dive into my thoughts, l let's go back to that. How did you not know that there were checkpoints? Because I don't pay attention to tutorials. It, it, it pops up on the screen, like, like when you die at a boss, it says, do you want to revive at the at the steak, the, the finely cooked medium rare steak, or do you want to revive at the uh, side of grace? Yeah, but I just assumed that was like a not a thing I actually wanted to do. Wait, so I don't pay attention to tutorials. I thought it was like a point at, from the Kyle, beginning of the game. No! Oh, Kyle, no. You could have saved yourself so much. Oh, man. Was there any like any particular boss where like god damn it now I gotta run all the way back to this shit over and over that you were getting like frustrated with? Uh all of them? Kyle, no! <laughs> yes, it's absolutely my, all my, of them. My poor summer child, Kyle. <laughs> uh, I think uh, getting to Radon was probably the most irritating. Oh, yeah. Like, I can that it, like, see that. But I'd like go back through the cutscene and all that shit again. How, how many times did it take you to kill Radon? I, I, I'm surprised because like I've been hearing everyone talk about I got into Elden Ring like maybe two weeks after everyone else did. Everyone's talking about Radon being like this big old fucking badass. He's supposed to be like the hardest boss in the game and uh i got him on my first try maybe i was over leveled maybe i was exploring other places but yeah no i got through it pretty easy uh his attacks were pretty easily telegraphed him yeah no i, I, had, a, I had a pretty easy time I, I felt sad about killing the horse um yeah no he wanted to live but i said nay so it's, it is what it is did you have a tough time with him my first time yeah first time was pretty rough After what was that, it the, what was, was it, it got you was it like the arrows or the his big old swingy swings no it's just it was just, just in general i it was different things every time like it was literally it was never a consistent thing it's just always had different problems well you're playing like more of a more of like a mage build right uh at the time no at the time i was just playing a just a regular just doing a, a dex strength build regular old stabby stabby boy it was also my first souls game so i mean yeah. that was part of why i had trouble not everyone can be a seasoned veteran but yeah it, it's fun yeah, jumping now into i'm on like now i'm on, on like my third playthrough jesus christ <laughs> Grant, granted the new the new game plus stuff it's it's a little bit easier because uh, do the bosses not scale so you can just like go through and like steam oh no they them? do no oh, they okay. scale everything scales oh shit okay never mind fuck that that's yeah I, and i didn't impressive. fight i didn't fight millennia in any of my previous playthroughs so i'm having to fight her for the first time i'm gonna play through three i just beat um i just beat what, what's his name Mor morgan morgan uh i got him first try too i was actually pretty happy about that i yeah, know i'm I'm just having like a really solid time with Elden Ring. Like, uh, unlike uh, pure vir virgin baby boy Kyle right here, I've played all the other Souls games. So granted, I have a little bit more knowledge about it. I'm, I'm rocking that tiny PP energy, as one might say, in the tiny PP district known as playing Souls games like a fucking loser. Yeah, no, I'm loving it. Loving the open world. If, if I were to rate Elden Ring within like the pantheon of Souls games, it'd probably be up upper, upper middle. I still kind of like the more linear, condensed nature of some of the other games maybe some of the aesthetics did you run into any of the any of the bears just randomly spawning from like random dudes yeah the one that you get the mimic tier one definitely got me the first time wait there is but one over I, there oh you poor soul there there's the one, one there's one that there's one that you fight and he turns into a a, a, a bear and then he gives he's a guy he turns into a bear and then when you kill him he gives you a mimic tier Oh shit, I didn't even know that. Cause like the one I ran into, I believe it was um the first area you starting to go a little bit east. It was just like a random dude. I stabbed him. I'm just like, okay, one hit kill, whatever. All of a sudden a giant bear jumps up and I'm only like level five and it's bear comes swiping at me. And I was like, it's not even a horror game, but god damn, that scared the fucking shit out of me. It was it was, it was beautiful. And then you get around to um what, what what's the red, sandy, freaking scarlet rod area? That that's uh Kalid. You run into those weird freaking giant werewolf head t-rex looking motherfuckers with the little human arms and there's like the bird equivalents i was like man the fucking i 
aesthetic and like world building in this game not, not even necessarily lore but just seeing like how everything's all spread out to uh to the geography it's pretty wild it's uh fucking freaky you, you don't even like horror games did that freak the shit out of you a little bit a little bit maybe a little was, maybe a little it wasn't, streak in the diaper it wasn't it wasn't too bad not too bad it scared the fuck out of me do you know what the fuck is up with the goats rolling around like all over the place like they'll just get in like little cartwheels and just roll around at the speed of sound i have not encountered that you haven't i have not i guess you just don't try to slaughter as many goats as i do i need, I need to make arrows dude i don't want to pay for that shit i'm fucking cheap as fuck yeah there's only one goat in my game and it's me <laughs> motherfucker fuck yeah <laughs> I should have seen that coming. That, that was smooth though, that was smooth. Yeah, it, it's Elden Ring. I, I don't want to go on for, for too long on Elden Ring because I'm sure I'm still going to be playing it fucking two weeks from now. Uh, so yeah, should have more material for that. Oh, oh, uh, what's your current build that you're rolling with? Uh, I've not played it in like two or three weeks, so I'm honestly not sure off the top of my head. Uh, well, for people that want to be based and uh, Chad pilled like, like me, uh, you can be a little basic baby bitch. Uh, have a shield, 100%. Um, physical negate damage. I, I'm using the same one from when I was like level five. And the starter uh, katana you get from being the samurai. I know people like to get all nice and fancy about, about hunting down special weapons for, uh, for min-maxing, whatever, do weird shit. No, just get a regular ass katana. You can do bleed damage. It's fucking beautiful. Don't worry about it. Don't stress over all this, over these high IQ moves. You're gonna be a dumb little bitch and you can still get really good results. Give me your end sample today. Oh shit, did Mason, you just pop in. This is the second time, motherfucker. What? You just randomly pop. How long have you been in here? Me? Yeah. I, I mean, I, what do you mean in here? You, I did not consent. You just kind of burst in. Oh, there. yeah, of course. Oh, wow, it's private. You're right. You know what? I wasn't thinking. <laughs> I hope, I hope my presence isn't too much. If it is, I will leave. Damn. I mean, I, I didn't even feel you, like, enter. I, I'm sorry. I mean, I, I'm not trying to be a dick. Uh, I didn't... Yeah, I'm sorry. I didn't read. That was, to be honest. That was smooth. I'll be honest. I just straight didn't read. Am, am, am I just that loose that I just didn't feel it? Um... Like, like who, who's who's in the who's in the slighted part here? I, I, I will add water, you this water base loop. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't realize. Shit. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm stupid. <laughs> Shit. Uh, Mesa, do you have any quick thoughts on uh, Elden Ring? You got a quick little. Build. Oh my god. Uh, nope. I'm still. Uh, nope. I'm. I'm still Dex. I'm still Dex. Still uh, Dex. I don't really feel like changing. Don't really feel like changing, honestly. Oh, I got like I got like 60 in my Dex. That's all I'm focusing on. I got my. I, I've been using the soft cap guide that uh, that Kyle sent me a freaking forever ago. Figure oh. at 40, stamina 40. Just focusing all on Dex right now. You, I just realized really. what I walked into. You need to you need to change the title, dog. Change the title. Yeah, the, the room. What's the room called? Private. Yeah, I like it, this it part. It's my private. That. It's my private part, dude. You uh, you're in my you, private uh, part right now. You need you need to um add a little bit a little little extra to it. I'm just saying. That's all I'm saying. Is my private part not sufficient for you? No, no, just put, it just put that it's just put that it's for the show so people know. Yeah, I'm stupid. You see, I wa I, I I just gave a <laughs> urine sample, so I came in here pretty excited. Oh, uh, shit. <laughs> I there's literally nothing important going on in video games, but we absolutely need to know about your urine sample. Yeah, what's uh, it's, your it's, urine sample? It's, it's so they don't know I'm not doing any drugs, so they can see if I have ADHD. They can tell ADHD from piss? Well, no, they need to check that I'm not doing any illegal drugs so that I'm a moral person, and I deserve getting my, <laughs> my ADHD <laughs> checked out. It's the way the world should work. If, if they is so if they do test for ADHD I got means via, tested. Via, via, via piss do they know that you do have ADHD if you come back without piss in the cup and you're just like well fuck I got distracted dude I don't know what to tell you is, oh, is no. that the test? all I know all I know is that they gave me a little uh, wet towelette and I cleaned my cup using the sink and soap uh in the bathroom so yeah. I now have an extra towelette that I can just use for whatever I want you, you had wait you had to clean the cup that you just pissed in i mean the out the outside i don't want it to be gross oh you didn't want to hand it over like fucking piss driblets all over the side I mean, there wasn't but um are you, are the, you uh, the introduction you of um of a uh, of a bodily fluid d deserves a clean a cleaning from everything involved with that process did you get any smegma in there no why not dude it's like i i, I bathe that's not very day. generous 
That's not generous at all. I have none to give. That's like free cottage cheese, dude. I don't think you know what cottage cheese is. Yeah, it's fucking disgusting. So I imagine anything would taste it's like better consistency. than that. It's like consistency. It's a bit of a... It's like a, like a tapioca pudding consistency. It's fucking gross is what it is. I, what, I actually don't know what cottage cheese is in the first place. I mean, That's is it actually food. cheese? Kyle, Kyle, you're... I mean, yeah. Kyle, what, what is cottage cheese? And is it... And what? how is it compared to smegma? I, I don't eat cottage cheese. Like, what, like... What? The only cottage cheese I like is the cottage cheese on soccer moms. I don't know, cottage cheese is ass, dude. Which I, I, don't, I guess I've it goes back to what I was saying, do, like, yeah, that is cottage just, cheese ass. Do, do you just do you just eat it? Like, with the spoon? Do you put it on something? I actually have no idea of anything with cottage cheese. Like, whatsoever. I don't know. Yeah, my no, freaking girlfriend, I, I, my girlfriend and her family love it, and they're white, so I figured it was white people. Really? I, I never had it in my life. I mean, no wonder. Neither have I. I realize. Oh, it's just in the TV shows I watch. Yeah. And they say white people don't have culture. They, they exactly. literally have cultured milk. It's, it's, it's like as, literally. as cultured as you can get. Exactly. Well, it's, un, it's uncultured, right? It's pasteurized. Yeah, that's that's why they go to church so much. They have the, they have their pasture. Exactly. Yeah. What's what's your Elden Ring build looking like? <laughs> Mine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's moon. It's Moonvale on one arm, Uchi on the other, and a cool cape. I mean, that's pretty much it. I'm, 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 I'm taking. I'm doing the. I'm doing the. Um, you rocking the, basic the cool bitch like me? Of course. I get, yeah, there you go. Blood. Got blood. I got magic. I got um. Getsu got ten shows. So I'm good. I got everything I ever could want. Yeah, shit. Fuck it. There you go, man.